Hey guys, this is Divessa here. So today I want to talk about something we get a lot of questions about and that's the alpha skills and where to place your alphas in your march. So the biggest factor for this is your skill ranges. <clears throat> Sorry, I have like my throat's getting sore. Okay, so right here I have like a little PowerPoint that I made just for showing this. And so right here I have my pro troop and this is technically my second or my troop one. It's not a viable like troop or anything. I just wanted to be able to show you guys the skill ranges and how to read them. So first one that we're going to do is a short range combat skill. This one is from Giraffe. I believe it's skill two and it is a range of two. So what that means, what that means is it's only going to be able to reach two alphas away from it. Right here is the first, right there is second. So that's as far as it can reach. So if it's any further back, it won't reach as far into the enemy's line. The next skill we're going to look at is a long range combat skill. And this is from the Siberian Tiger and I believe it's skill 5. So this one has a range of 5 so what that means is it can hit up to 5 places away from it. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. It can be essentially anywhere in the lineup and it will hit. And then right here we have a buffing skill, a support skill. <clears throat> this skill is going to apply to its own, like comrades. It has a skill range of two, which to be honest, I'm not sure if it doesn't matter if it goes one way or the other, or if it goes both ways, as far as like, if you put it in the middle, will it apply to both sides? I'm pretty sure it does as long as it's no more than two away. So this one has a skill range of two and then right here it can it can reach everyone in your line. So another commonly asked question that we get asked, let me turn this off, is about the alphas. The alf oh shoot, hold on. My uh, screen is lagging out a little bit. All right, so another question we get asked is about the range, melee, and support. So Kodiak Bear is a ranged alpha. What this means is it's pretty much a combat alpha. It does damage. It's going to it's going to hit and it's going to hit it could potentially hit hard usually with ranged alphas their skills are going to be higher than three they're going to be three or higher okay so our next one is going to be i believe that one's arranged we can look at giraffe gotta let it catch up giraffe is melee this means that for the most part, he has short range skills. That does not mean he has to go in first place. It just means he has short range skills. And then the last thing, let me see if I can pull it up because I don't actually have it. Uh, Snow Leopard. <clears throat> Snow Leopard is support. So what support means is that, see this is what it's what it says. Me for it's good for leading middle or back squads, but if I'm not mistaken. See, there's two, and there's just all squads. So his skills is only two away. So pretty much support means he buffs his own. That's all it means. 
it just means he buffs his own and you want to judge where you want to put your alphas solely based on their skill ranges if you put an alpha with a skill range of two in your back line he's not going to hit anything he's just going to be there he's going to be chilling having a martini or something like that he ain't going to be doing nothing in the fight so anyway that's alpha's skill ranges and i hope you guys enjoyed and this helped clear up some stuff see you next time